What is going on guys? It is Jaco back again with another pure slasher video in the park today. Uh, today we had some good games. It was, uh, uh, today we're playing with uh, the Slash Shot Creator, uh, Mark's new build. And right away we get some bums. They're the HJJHGFFGHHGGF clan. They are 1 in 6 overall, and you will see quickly they deserve to be 1 in 6. Watch this, they're going to disrespect the stretch right off the bat. He's going to get the wide open 3, bang, right off my assist. This, uh, the stretch in the other team, he was alright, but, like, you know, he obviously had to be better to beat us. But, uh, right away, I don't get a wide open, uh, uh dunk, so I'm passing it right back to my stretch. I'm going to get the easy spin lay-in right there. I try to do a spin dunk, try to be... A little bit more flashy but you know it's all right we're gonna get another wide open three but he's not gonna make it. i'm gonna grab the rebound and now i'm just gonna put it right back up on their heads for the easy dunk <clears throat> right here we're up 14 to 4 really early this kid's gonna try and sauce me we're gonna leave the stretch wide open he's gonna miss i'm gonna grab the rebounds and i'm gonna take it all the way look at that nice little front clutch dunk right there man and I have my takeover. I get the heavily contest right there. Um, stretch wants to take it all the way, but he ends up losing it. The uh, stretch on the other team wants to take the uh, easy mid-range shot, but I grab the rebound. And I'm going to take it all the way, and I'm going to dunk on this kid. Look at this. Disrespectful, dude. I'm heads and shoulders above this kid. He, he had no chance. I mean, I did have my takeover. There's no reason to try and block a slasher in his takeover, unless you're a pure rim, to be honest, or pure lock. Then again, if I have my takeover and your pure lockdown, you, you better have your takeover too, because if you don't have your takeover, you're not gonna stop. So right away, we fall to the sweats, 0-4. Pretty quickly, um, <clears throat> they're gonna leave the stretch wide open. I don't know why, but they're just gonna disrespect him right away, which we're perfectly fine with. And then uh, somehow my uh, stretch or something, or whoever's on me, I forgot, uh, makes a really shitty layup on me, so. I wasn't too fond about that, but right away, I'm going to get wide open in the corner, and I'm going to splash that, get us the lead, 9-8. to eight. We still got a little bit of a lead here. We don't want any threes, so I'm uh, playing high on the threes and making sure we get uh, they get no threes. And I let up an easy dunk, but that's all right because right here, we're going to do something great. Check this out. Wide open in the corner. Nah, I'm going to take it and take the easy reverse layup right there. Get a two-point lead, and they're going to try and uh, get a three here. He gets the poke, but it goes right to the stretch. I should have played up a little bit higher on the stretch because he's going to make this, but it's all right. We got the secret weapon, the stretch and takeover, so we're just going to try and get him open and get an easy three out of it. So right away, I'm just going to pass it right back to the stretch. He's going to off-ball cheese and get the wide open three to win the game. Uh, right away these guys played a lot of games like they played a lot of games it's five six hundred each but uh yeah they're, they weren't too good their uh, record wasn't that good and they, i feel like they've been watching youtube and like what's the best build to win up threes at a park out because I, I need those builds because we suck guys we're terrible but uh yeah they end up being terrible and then these two shots show it perfectly i'm gonna get wide open for some reason world does not know how to point his joystick so i'm not gonna get it in stride but that's all right he's gonna throw another bad pass he could have passed that way earlier but that's all right stretch is wide open and he's gonna splash that three right there and so right away uh we got an okay lead seven to six it's still early um world right there is gonna float i'm getting glenn robinson dunks ain't a joke but his stretch i don't know i don't even know what happened i got a terrible animation he's gonna get a wide open lap we're gonna give it to me right off the inbound because i'm just gonna get wide open for the euro laying easy buckets man kind of wanted to branch that into a euro dunk but it doesn't matter i'm gonna get the tip but it's gonna go right back to him i'm just gonna let it bounce off my chest you know professional basketball players do not have hand eye Right here, I'm going to catch the ball in stride and do a little bit of a switcheroo myself. I got my takeover now. Right away, World gets the uh, steal right off the inbound, and I'm going to do a nice-looking cradle Julius Irvin dunk at the other end. So right here, I'm going to get an easy tip. I don't know how I got that tip, but it's all right. I'm going to easy take the easy dunk on the other end. And it's 17-8. Now, this, these kids were actually buns. <laughs> They're going to go for the touchdown pass. 
they're not gonna make it we're gonna grab the rebound once again and I'm they're looking for me in transition I get another wide open dunk but uh yeah that's pretty much it for the video today guys hopefully you guys enjoyed um once again if you guys want to see my shot creator um or my slasher more be sure to let me know I'm down to play on whatever depending on who and what I play with so yeah hope you guys enjoyed be sure to drop a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video okay bye